Today we will calculate the correlation coefficient R using a Casio calculator. First press the mode button. We then select two marked STAT for statistics. You are then presented with a number of statistical modes. We will select mode number 2 which shows the formula for the line A plus BX. Having selected mode number 2 you are then presented with a two column table marked X and Y. We will keep it simple today using just three values for X and Y. The three values we will use for X are 3 4, 3 and the values for Y are 7, 8, 6. So we first press the digit 3 and to enter that we press the equal to sign. Having pressed the equal to sign you will see that the value 3 is the first value for X and the cursor moves on to allow you to enter the second value for X. We then press 4 followed by the equal to sign. The cursor then moves on to the forward position. We then use the replay button to navigate to the first Y position. When the cursor is on the first row of the Y column we press the number 7 as that is the first Y value. Having selected the number 7, we then press the equal to sign to en enter. On some new Casio calculators, the equal to sign is shown as EXE, as in execute. We then select 8 as the second value for Y. And again we hit the equal to sign to enter the value 8. We press the key, key number 6 for our third value y value which is 6 again followed by the equal to sign to enter that value. Now this is probably the most unintuitive part. When you have all the values for x and y entered you press the AC button. You can take this as asking the Casio calculator to perform the calculations. We now want to display our statistical calculations so we first press the shift button to give us the second function. We then press 1 which of course is the second function for the button 1 which is marked stat stat in yellow over the button. We can now select the results we required. On this calculator it's number 7 for regression and remember the Casio calculators can vary a little bit so again on this we press number 7 for regression. You are now presented with a number of choices. We set out to look for the value of R which is indicated by a small r which on this calculator is number 3. So we will go ahead and select 3 followed by enter. We are now presented with the value for R which is equal to 0 0.8660 etc. And remember the value for R, the correlation coefficient, must lie between minus 1 and plus 1. If you don't, if your answer doesn't lie within this range, there's something wrong with your calculations. That is really the end of the demonstration as we have calculated our value R, the correlation coefficient. SEO calculator is a very powerful tool and it's worth your while uh, becoming competent or expert in its use and you'll only do this by practicing it. So thanks for watching and best of luck with your studies.